Hey, what's up guys? It's Banu here from Android.com. This is the Huawei Mate 30 Pro. If you watch my full review of the Huawei Mate 30 Pro by now, I'm sure that you will agree that this phone is really awesome. But in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can multiply the awesomeness of the Mate 30 Pro by adding an extra value add-on to it and that is the Google Play Store. So this is what I promised you guys in my full review as well. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can sideload the Google Play Store as well as all the Google services so that you can make this a complete smartphone. If you are excited for this video, definitely smash that like button, share this video with your friends and smash the subscribe button as well if you are new to my channel. And let's get started with today's video. The first thing you need to do is you need to head down over to the description and download the file that is given down there just like this so you can go ahead and open it up and then download it onto your computer. Once you have done that you can grab a pen drive and transfer that file onto this pen drive and after that you need to grab hold of a USB type C dongle just like this because the next step is to connect this pen drive onto our Huawei Mate 30 Pro itself. So I'm gonna grab the pen drive just like this and then go ahead and plug it in to the Mate 30 Pro using this dongle. Once that is done, the next thing you need to do is from the Mate 30 Pro, you need to go, go ahead and open up the Huawei Files application that is built right into it. Then you can go ahead and select this USB drive that is there. And then you will find this folder called gms.zip. So you can select that and you can go ahead and hit on Extract to, and then select the current directory and hit on OK. So I've already extracted it, that's why I got that power up, but if not, it will automatically go ahead and extract. Once it's, it's done, it will open, open this thing up. So here you will find a zip called Huawei.zip. So just select that, go to more, go to extract to, and in this, the next step is very important. So you need to go ahead and hit on select directory, press OK, and then you need to select the pen drive itself, and then go ahead and uh, extract that onto the pen drive itself once that is done you need to go ahead and go into the settings area then you need to go into system and updates and then you need to go into backup and restore and then you need to go go to data backup once it's done you need to go to usb storage here you will find this backup file so you need to go ahead and hit on that and then it will get selected and then you need to go ahead and hit on restore. So here it's asking for a password. If you don't know the password, you can type A and seven zero. So let me do that once again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A with seven zeros and then you need to go ahead and hit on OK. So now the restore will begin and the restore has now successfully completed. The next thing you need to do is you have to go back into the files and then from here you need to go into that GMS folder and get into this Google folder that is there and then you have to go ahead and install all of these APKs that are there. So you need to go ahead and hit on this APK just like this then go ahead and hit on allow and hit on install and then once it's done hit on done. So the, uh, next one is for the contacts can go ahead and install it, done, then the Google Play services, hit on install. Some files might take longer than the others, so be patient until the installation process is completed so that you can get the full Google experience on your device. Next, we are going to go ahead and install the Google Play Store, so I'm installing it just like this, hit on done, then you need to go to Google services framework, hit on install, hit on done. Then the shared library, hit on install and hit on done. So once that's done, now all these APKs have been installed and once you go into the home screen, now you will see all of these things and we have the Google Play Store on our device. But the tutorial is not done just yet. We have to do one more thing. Once you have all the APKs installed, the next thing you need to do is you need to go ahead and hit on this G icon and then go ahead and hit on activate and press on allow. Once you get into this screen, all you have to do is hit on this button once, hit on this, 
and that's about it now you need to go back into the home screen hit on the power button hold on it and then hit on restart once your phone has successfully restarted the next thing you need to do is go ahead and eject this pen drive just remove it from your device and now we are done the google play store is now ready for you to use you can download any application or game from this you need to go ahead and hit on the sign in button over here give it a second or two to load up and then you have to go ahead and sign in to your google account and then once that's done you can enjoy all the apps and all the games that are available on the google play store on your huawei mate 30 pro so hit on that sign in button just like this give it a few seconds and then you can go ahead and sign into this and use it so let me quickly show you that right now so i'm going to log into my account just like this and then i can go ahead and accept everything so just like that now we have the google play store running on our huawei mate 30 pro so i can go ahead and install any application right now if i want whatsapp i can do that very easily i can go ahead and hit on that install button and get it installed onto my device if i want facebook i can do that the complete google play store experience is now on the mate 30 pro so this just makes this phone so much better this is the missing piece on the mate 30 pro now we have that with this video i hope you guys were able to get that up and running on your mate 30 pro itself in case if you guys didn't check out my other videos on the mate 30 pro definitely go to my channel and check them out and if you like what you see smash that subscribe button right now for more awesome tech videos just like this right here on android dollar well guys that's about it for this video i hope you guys found this video useful if you did definitely go ahead and share this video with someone who has a Huawei Mate 30 Pro who, or who might be considering to pick up a Mate 30 Pro and uh, if you're new to my channel and, and if you want to see more exclusives just like this definitely go ahead and smash that subscribe button right now it's completely free and uh, also hit on that notification bell icon so that you will be notified each and every time I upload a new video here on YouTube Follow me on social media, I am at Android Dollar, all the links are given down below in the description. That's where you'll see all the behind the scenes and updates from my channel. And stay tuned to AndroidDollar.com for all the latest from the tech world. Until I see you guys in my next video, this is Banu, signing out.